Murray Smith, the second time I fight him. Now he's been training for like four months in the Shamrock camp, in the Lion's Den camp. Kick to the body. Right low kick, right, right straight back. Push kick, punch to the head. And now he takes me down actually. So we're on the ground. He's playing a real tight game here. You see, he's, he's, he's crawling all the way on me so that I cannot go for an arm bar or maybe a triangle choke or, or, or anything. But I want him to get up. This is like a front choke that I'm doing, but it doesn't have a lot of effect. Sometimes people get frustrated with it and it might work to get him a little kind of a panic reaction. See, this is what I'm doing now. I'm pulling his head down and my forearm is on his throat, but he gets out. I go for an armbar. He escapes beautifully and he goes to the side mount. He says, get up. Up. All right. You just heard Jason Delucia say, nice liver shot. He's tired already. He's in his corner, in Murray Smith's corner, and you will hear me saying to him, no way, Jason. Watch this. This is such a beautiful move. I make an upside down knee bar. We will go back to that, to all these actions at the end of the fights, like we did before. And then you will hear me talking to Jason and those things. They're funny things. Right straight to the body. He came back with the right uppercut. Now he wants to neck crank me back. The can opener is also what they call it. Break. Break, nothing happens. And of course the people want to see us on our feet because we're both strikers. Whoa. That's a right and the liver shot again with the left. I let myself fall back now because I figure if I can submit him in the first uh, fight two times, I can submit him right now too. Especially when he's in the half guard because then you can turn him to the side. You watch. There we go. But now we're under the ropes. I'm here trying to open his guard, to break his guard, go to the side, and go for a leg lock, which now kind of was wrong again uh, for me, but now he's in my half guard. If he makes a mistake by putting his left arm around my neck, I'm going to turn him right away to the right. Watch. One, two, three. Here we go. I slide my arm around his neck, right away into a choke, and he's stepping already. And the fight's over. Real naked choke. Let's look at this upside down knee bar. Watch, I reposition myself, my right foot I put in between his legs and now I turn to go for a knee bar. Only he holds the ropes, which makes this a very strange looking knee bar upside down. From here, 
He holds my body. I twist him around on his side and his mistake is now turning into me, which exposes his neck. I slide in my choke and yes, this is pretty much giving the choke to me. And he already tapped out there.